and I too, if I was 13, in the same vicinity as Mark Lee, annoy him enough to the point that he quit the company or got close enough to it heavily considered it? I would do that. I will do that. Let me be 13 and go into the company. Hello babes. Today is quite possibly and with no exaggeration and I'm not lying and this is completely truthful and this is real. The most important day ever. Check the facts. For one, I'm wearing a cute outfit. Like I look freaking cute, cute, cute. And today I just so happen to be painting uh, what could be said to be my favorite little guy on the freaking planet. And uh, let me check the facts on that. Uh, yeah, <laughs> that's correct. To anyone who knows me, knows anything about me, the question of who the heck is this guy was quickly answered. Don't talk about it. Because it's simple. It's honestly uh, quite easy. He's present in the background of every video. I think you can see him about eight times. So who is this little devious rapscallion, problem solver, a ruiner of lives, great singer, hot, sexy, beautiful, lovely, evil? Who could it be? Who could be my favorite little guy on the planet? No exaggeration. All my behavior makes sense considering this is my favorite little guy on the planet. Hey, Chan of NCT. Let it be known that he is my old bias, and l like I've said many times, my favorite person on the planet, but he is my old, 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 old bias, and I mean that. And I too, if I was 13, in the same vicinity as Mark Lee, annoy him enough to the point that he quit the company, or got close enough to it, heavily considered it, I would do that. I will do that. Let me be 13 and go into the company. I have not ever oil painted him. I don't draw him too often and I don't paint him. Why? Good question. I can't answer that. I don't know. That's why we're doing it now. I love him so, so much and... <laughs> I don't even know what I was saying. It's like he does everything for me. It's uh, honestly, it's like Hitch and it's like, it's like NCT, they do everything for me. They said, we know you love tangerines. Tangerine love. We know you love Hitchin. He's on the stage. We know that you love vampires and you're having a weird vampire era. Favorite vampire, right in the middle. We know that you love red hair Yuta. Red hair Yuta exists. We know your birthday is March 28th. A whole album. They do everything for me. It's crazy. Like we just have a connection like me and NCT and me and HM. Like that's different from what like you have with them. Like, cause like with us, it's like, it's like that we just like get each other and like you, you just don't get it. I have little things, none of them normal, that I tend to really enjoy. Little themes in pictures. And one of those happens to be little cuts. <laughs> interesting. Interesting, I'd say. I happen to enjoy whenever in stage makeup and different concepts where they have like little cuts on their nose, little cuts on their cheek, and I like it. They gave me not one, but two different visual concepts where Hei-chan has little band-aids on his face. And I love that. And thank you. And I love that. This is a picture that we painted. <laughs> and he's got a little blood in the corner of his mouth and he looks silly. There is an elephant in this room. There is an elephant in this room. And that is the emoji shirt. Now I truly, as it does fit his vibe, I wish it, ugh. as much as the emoji shirt is like literally so him, if Hedgehog was an emoji, he would be the devil emoji. Just because he is, for all intents and purposes, the devil emoji does not mean they had to put him in that shirt. I can't believe the first Hedgehog that I'm ever gonna paint, he's wearing a devil emoji shirt. If I were to actually paint my favorite man on the planet wearing a devil emoji shirt and just like have that, I would never be able to take this seriously. And me being a person that loves serious things and is very serious and takes everything seriously, that's a big concern for me. What we'll be doing is not painting devil emojis. I'm sorry if there's any devil emoji shirt stands. That's not happening. <laughs> uh, we are going to just change them to circles and random abstract shapes. I feel like I've jabbered. I think I've yapped. I've talked too much. To be to be frank, I've talked too much and you're gonna hear me talking a lot more about how I like hate you. I like hate you a lot. Without further ado, let us just get into doing the painting of Hen that I'm very excited about. Yeah.
it has been three hours. You're not allowed to talk about my Hello Kitty pimple patch or P1 Harmony playing in the background because P1 Harmony makes a distinct barrier wall between me and my family so they can't hear this. I'm in a P1 Harmony bubble and my family can't hear me talking to my phone. The task that I gave myself was finishing the background and parts of the hair that didn't interfere with the face too much. What I did was most of that, but resonance of that that I did do, it kind of looks delicious and new one snazzy like it kind of looks it kind of looks like i was hungry and i ate but something that has occurred that i still don't know the solution for that i hate is that in other paintings when i do a solid wash there's no streakiness and no aggressive glare but every time i use van dyke brown or black there is and i don't know how to go i don't know how to get rid of it like what do I do? I may act like I'm the expert. I am not. I'm in fact not the expert. I'm the town fool. I'm the court jester. I'm the person in the town who's in the little, that, that thing. I don't know anything. From here with the painting, what I will do is finish the background of the hair. Honestly, I'm kind of doing everything backwards. I'm kind of free bird. Honestly, I might do the shirt first and leave the face for last. Isn't that crazy? There are no rules. I honestly have no idea what I'm going to do next. We will continue painting. Okay. Hello. The pop filter is still missing, but Hei Chen is not. He's always here. I'm always carrying his love with me. And I move one Hei Chen and the other is right behind. If I could find a tiny little sock, like a tiny sock that would fit over this mic, would that be funny if I had a tiny sock as the pop filter? I think so, personally. His face is entirely done and the background, and it's been 11 hours and 11 minutes. 11, 11! My wish is... And you don't get to know what it is and it is not Hei Chen related so <laughs> don't <laughs> don't think that it is <laughs> somewhere in the middle where I was like oh I'm past my deadline because I always am I decided I don't really care that I'm past my deadline I just want it to look good which is something new because uh, usually I rush through the painting so I can get it out on a scheduled time and then it ends up not looking as good as I wanted it to because I rushed through it but this is important because because I decided I don't care that it's late. I just really want it to look good and I want to be proud of it and I want to love it and I want to freaking smile whenever I look at it and be happy. But let's take a peek at the little man. So this, yeah, uh, masking tape isn't really doing the trick recently, but I think it looks like genuinely, like let's be genuinely genuine for a second. I think it looks so good, so freaking 
I think it looks literally so freaking good. Like, I literally love it. And it's not even done. I still have to go in and add more hair around his face, like little stray hairs um, and stuff, and then do his shirt. But like, I still, I like really, really like it. I like really, really love it. And I mean this, like sometimes I do lie. Like, <laughs> I gotta be into photo cards. Like I'd be lying. Sometimes I really just don't really like the paintings that I do, but we keep a positive attitude. But I'm being completely genuine. I love this. This is my, this is the favorite thing that I've ever done. And that's how I wanted, that's by my design, of course. I wanted my favorite guy to be my favorite painting, obviously. I'm very nervous about doing the hair strokes because I still have not found a good method for making really nice thin hair strokes. I, I don't know if it, it's probably something wrong with me, but I can't figure it out. Like I literally have tried, I've tried everything. I tried using my hair. I, one of the clips of me painting, you're not gonna be able to see it because it's 800 times speed, but I, I went for a good tug. I went for a good tug and I took my little hair out of my scalp for science. And it did not work. The science, the facts, and the science, check the facts, it didn't work, okay? I'm gonna have to figure out something else for that. But I still freaking love it. Like, literally so much. Hello. Hello. We have to move on to the sweater. No emojis. We're gonna collectively, as, as a society, as a group here, forget that there was emojis on the sweater. Because there's not going to be. There's just gonna be little fun abstract shapes and circles. Check the facts on this one, babe. He was not wearing an emoji shirt. Those were doctored images. And Johnny Sa, he didn't go to the Met Gala. Check the facts on that. That was fake. Johnny Sa was not at the Met Gala. Hey Chan did not wear an emoji shirt. These are the facts of the matter. And you should... Check the facts, go and check that. And I did a new method with the skin because recently, there were people who have been coming out with their little promo images. They have this nice, this lovely grainy quality to it. Crisp grain. I love a good crisp grain. It sounds like someone's name. So if your name is crisp grain out there, well, you know my feelings on you. I would say, do the highlight in the mid-tone, mix it together like I normally would, and then usually I'd be done. But this time, I went over with the highlight and I like scumbled it back on. And I think it worked to my advantage. And I truly, truly think that. Right now, he is having him time. He's having hey Chan time and he is drying. And then we'll return and we'll paint the sweater, the emoji-less sweater. And we will smile, live, laugh, love, have fun, and we will love hey Chan. And I've been doing that for a while now. So, if you're not and you haven't, um, check the facts you're gonna start doing that. So, but now, we will move on. And we will move on to the sweater. And then, the outro. And I hope you had a cool time so far. It's time to paint the sweater. The plain sweater. is freaking done. My little baby bear is freaking complete, dude. Are you ready for the grand reveal? Ayo hey, DJ, can we switch it up a bit? Here's the grand reveal. Here is fact check HN painting. Yeah. I am actually very surprised with this. Um, it is genuinely probably one of my favorite pieces I've ever done. It's in the list. It's in the top five, top 10. Uh, I'm so happy I finally decided to paint him. I'm surprised I actually got it finished because I all you need to know is it's done. And if you would like to see pictures of Hechan and all the other things I painted on this channel, then you can go to Ashbizu, same spelling as the channel, and you can see pictures and stuff of it and love it and love Hechan. Go to Hechan H A E H A C H E N on Instagram. <laughs> I'm very surprised by this. Already from the beginning, I was kind of like, oh wow, I'm like blowing it out of the freaking water. But I was also nervous because like he's my bias. Like I had to do him justice, obviously. I was trying some new things, nerve wracking. Every painting is a little nerve wracking, but this one was a little bit heightened because I have to make my favorite, 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 favorite guy 
look swell. And I, I gotta keep breaking the ceilings. The breaking the walls, break the wall, ATs. I gotta keep going higher and higher and getting better and better, dude. And I think I did that. I frog eyed. I frog eye blinked. I love it so much. I love freaking Hei Chan so much. And if you have missing, if you see him, please return to his home. Horang Hei, Hei Chan photo card from Fact Check. If you have him, give him to me. I'll give you Jungu. You can have my Jungu PC. Sorry, Jungu. Love you dearly. Here's the freaking facts you need to check. This Jungu PC is one of my favorite PCs that I've ever had of all time. So nothing against Jungu. He's my bias fucker. But I want that freaking HM. I want that freaking HM. Give me the HM. <laughs> Put it in my little freaking hands, dude. But I hope you enjoyed. I hope you had so much fun, silly little in citizens. I hope uh, you can. Uh huh. You can like the video. You can comment. Dude, freaking comment. Comments are my favorite. Free. I say this every video. Comments are my favorite. <coughs> Comments are my favorite thing to read. Please comment. I love reading and responding to comments and chit chatting. I like to freaking chit chat with you. So please comment and you can comment your NCT bias. We freaking know who mine is. Comment if you want me to paint anybody else from NCT. Anybody else you want me to paint, uh, in city, in city citizens. Um, just comment please and i will respond that is a factoid factoid of the day i will respond to the comment um you can like the video you can freaking you can freaking subscribe and you can click the little bell so you know which so you know which so you know, which so you know the next time that i post and maybe what you comment that you want me to do i make a video about and then you got notified so you know that i made the video about what you asked for so the natural order of things, butterfly effect, the circle of life. I got some socials in the description. Um, but it was pretty. I hope that you had fun and I hope you have a happy day, fun time. Love, hey Chan. I hope that you return and we have more fun. <laughs> hope we have more fun. <laughs> what I love, Yi Dong Hyuk. I love Yi Hei Chan, Yi Dong Hyuk, Sharang Hei O. Oh in a turn of phrase. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs>